Hey guys, I promised in my birthday vlog that I'd unbox this and show you some swatches. So I'll do the unboxing first. And yeah, I'll start off with the easy one because I'll have to move the camera for the next one. But I got the um. Mom, sore, big mascara sample for my birthday from Ulta. And you just kind of pop this down and slip it out. You won't be getting a swatch of this, but because it's just a mascara. And I can't apply mascara on camera, but I'm excited for that. Let's see. Now let's get into this. One second while I rearrange you. I've opened this actually for my birthday. But I figured you'd want to see it unboxed. Two, I'm wearing the lipstick today actually. First, we got one there. I don't know if it's a crayon, but it's in. Yeah, it's a lip crayon in Glance. Then, then we got sample of their lip balm and their lip scrub. Then we got a little mini lipstick of Chai. There's the mascara. Now for what I bought it. I got the Makeup Forever Professional Pairs. Um, what's it called? It is. I just got their little kit of. I think they called it Essentials. But yeah. Um, you just. Tape. Okay. We got a lip liner and a lip liner and whatever walnut. We got a full sized. I believe. Lipstick in. Um. I don't know. It says M103. And it's a pretty brown shade. Then we got a uh, Primer and one of their little setting powders. Then at Ulta, I got Color Pops. Got a minute. Lippy Sticks Bundle. Kinda of pretty looking. This one is in Brink. Daydream. Oh no no the this one's Daydream. And 
that. Pool digger. So, let me rearrange these and we can get a better shot. I'm really excited to play with this more. I'm wearing it today. Not that you can see it, but I've been wanting to try their lipstick for a while and um, haven't because that's kind of an intimidating price for lipstick for someone who's um, new to the high end stuff. But I'm also excited to try ColourPop because I've wanted to try their stuff forever. So, yeah. So, I may have forgotten some of the things in the Sephora haul. They gave me a sample of the Sephora charcoal wipes and some of their um, Sephora Beauty Uncomplicated Perfect foundation in light medium and darker medium so yeah that'll be interesting so um now back to the regular part of the video. here's the swatches <laughs> so guess who forgot she had several videos she had to still film parts for <laughs> me. So um, here's the swatches of my birthday haul. First we got Colourpop's lippy stick and gold digger. Here's Color Pops Lippy Stick and Brink. Ooh, those things smell good. And their Lippy Stick and Daydream. Next is Makeup Forever's M103. Ooh. It's metal, which is nice, but ooh, trying to take it off slow, which did not sound nice. Ooh. Doesn't have any smell to it. multi-purpose artist color pencil and whatever or wherever walnut brush too hard ah, mayday there's been an error you can barely well, you can see it on there, but you can barely see it on my lips. So, um, there's that color. Next is Bite Beauties Matte Lip Crayon and Clamps. Oh, it smells so good. And the 
the one I was most excited to get is Bite Beauty's Chai. And, okay, this is going to sound stupid, but if you've ever had those chocolate covered jelly things during Christmas, it kind of smells like one of those, and I really love it. And it, along with the other Bite Beauty thing, both have a flavor to them. So if you have a issue where like flavored, especially good flavored, lip balms and stuff on your lips make you kind of go, because you know, especially when you were younger, a lot of people tended to do that might not be for you. However, at least it's not a bad taste. But yeah, if you have that kind of problem, probably don't want to spend that much for a lipstick that you're going to try to lick off. But um, that's the end of this video. I hope the quality doesn't get ruined in processing because it's making me angry. But yeah, I will see ya.